the Wichita students. I am Zarin Olsey. I teach science at McLean Science and Technology Elementary Magnet School. And today we're just going to do a short and simple experiment with things that you probably have at home. All you need for this one is a cup, some water, a little tiny bit of dish soap, and a straw. Now, if you don't have a straw, you could use even like a coffee stirring stick. And if you don't have one of those, McDonald's drive through they give them away. So I'm going to pour a little bit of water into my cup, not very much, just a tiny bit. And I'm going to take my straw. And all I'm going to do, first of all, is I'm going to blow air through my straw. I want to make sure I can feel it on my hand. You can try blowing lightly. You can try blowing really strong. See the difference in how it feels on your hand. Now I'm going to do that into my cup. I'm not going to touch the water with my straw. I'm just going to blow. And my water is moving. Now I'm going to blow stronger. And I'm going to try and blow a hole in my water. And I can do that without even touching the straw into the water. Now I'm going to put my straw in my water and blow. And I'm starting to see bubbles coming into my water. And I can blow around the edge of my cup all the way around the circumference and see kind of what happens. And after I do that for a little while, I'm going to add just the tiniest little drop of dish soap. Now, it doesn't matter what kind of dish soap you have. It doesn't have to be Dawn. It could be any type. But I'm going to just add one drop of dish soap into my cup. And again, I don't have very much water in here, and I don't have very much soap in here. But let's see what happens when I blow. Now, you notice I'm holding the cup. I always make my students leave it on the table. So if you have long hair, you're going to want to pull it back. If you have short hair, you're good to go. But now I'm going to blow into my cup. Oh, did you see that big bubble? This is so much fun. And you can blow bubbles and build bubble clouds and sometimes get a really big one. Anyway, it's so much fun to experiment. Just need a little bit of water, one drop of dish soap, and you're good to go. Have fun.